I have rediscovered something in my life. I don't know about you, but, um, you know, sometimes I do something that's really good and for whatever reason, I stop doing it and I rediscover it. And that, for me, has been my free writing. So I wake up, I meditate, I pray, and uh, now I've added a third thing to this. This is right before I start my writing, and that is free writing. And it's really done me a lot of good. And part of that free writing helps me fix on my goals and my intents. And I believe my intents, like the things I intend to do, need to come first. And that's what I'm going to suggest for you today. And I want to get a little more in depth about how that works. Hi there, I'm Dada Groover with The Inspired Writer, and I have been doing a lot of planning. It's almost the end of 2021, and I've been thinking a lot about what I want to do for 2022 in terms of my writing plan, my goal, my goal and my intents, what I intend to do with my writing, and also what I intend to do with these videos. I want these videos to be a great tool for you. I want them to help you in your writing, in your creativity, and make a difference because that's what I am doing here in the world. So well, let me put it another way. That's what I intend to do here in the world. It sounds a little arrogant when I say it. That's what I'm doing. But um, that is what I intend to do. And one of the things I love about the whole free writing thing, and free writing is, there's not exact uh, spec, a specific rule as to how to free write, except just keep going, don't stop. So I have a notebook every morning, and I write by hand. I, I believe for most of us, it's going to work out better to write by hand, and I just let it flow. And I also really focus on what I intend to do, what I want to do. And one of the things I just came up recently with that is that I don't think it matters a lot what we do in the world, as long as we do it all the way and as long as we do it from the platform of our soul. If we do it from that level, then anything I think is going to be beneficial for us and beneficial for things around us. My intent is that I make a lot of difference in people's lives. That's what I want to do. That's what I believe is my purpose in life. And I also believe that it's a very, um, I don't want to say common, I want to say it's a common thread. Yeah, so I'm using common in a different way. It's a common thread that runs between all of us as human beings, that we want to make a positive difference in people's lives. So my intent for my writing plan is to, yes, I love writing, and here's where I'm making a big shift from 2020, from 2021, is I am going to put more into marketing. And do I like marketing? No, not at this point. I want to learn to like it, but I really want to market, and there's a reason because it because I want to do that, and that is that I want to make an impact on as many people as possible. I want people, uh, I want to inspire people to be their highest and best selves. That's what I want to do in the world. And I'm not going to do that effectively unless I really work on my marketing. Am I going to keep working on my, on my writing? Absolutely. And I study. I study writing on a virtually on a daily basis, at least five days out of out of the week. And I always find that there's room for improvement. And I want to do the same with my marketing. So my my goal, my strategy for 2022 is to become as good at marketing as I believe I am at writing. I believe that you know, I've done really well, uh, different, got 12 awards, 12 literary awards, and I'm very happy about that. And I understand I have a long way to go to reach my potential as a writer. So my goal is to uh, write regularly, which I have been doing. I've been doing that for years where I, again, I get up, I do my prayers, my meditation, now my free writing, and then I write for hours every single day, virtually without exception. And 
I'm going to keep that going and I'm also going to work on how I am going to get my books into people's hands, how I'm going to let them know about my message. So that is uh, my overarching goal for 2022. And how I plan to achieve that is to really dig deeper and to, I want to, in my writing, and I want to erase this conception that I'm a good writer. And I've been told I'm a good writer. I know some people think I'm a good writer, uh, which is awesome. That's great. That's very encouraging. But when I have the conception that I am a good writer, it tends to make me think that, well, I don't need to get better. You know, and I think that a lot of people plateau. Uh, writers do that. Musicians do that. Um, musical groups do that all the time. Um, you know, I, I mean, I could I could name certain groups, but uh, you know, it's like, well, no, they're so good still. And it's, yes, there's U two, right? The Irish rock band U two. Um, they plateaued at a certain point. Uh, and they had made some songs and albums uh, that were just amazing. I, in my, this is my subjective opinion, so I might be totally uh, not in line with your opinion about this. And then at, at a certain point, they just, you know, and people even asked, Bono was even asked, why have you not made any songs like, um, you know, Mysterious Ways or, you know, I still haven't found what I'm looking for and you know some of those classic songs that they made and he says well we're giving people what they want and I was really disappointed when I heard that <laughs> because it's like for me that's kind of a sellout Imagine Dragons another uh, band that I uh, have a lot of uh, respect for I believe plateaued recently uh, in the last few years and and yeah they still make great songs but um, I think not at the level of some of the original music. And so not to get into you know, music criticism and stuff, but I'm saying a lot of artists plateau. And I don't want to do that. And I believe that what happens is we plateau. We stop getting better when we think, yep, I'm already good. I want to have this conception. This is my plan. This is part of my plan for 2022 is I want to have that idea, that conception that I want to always improve to get closer to my highest and best self as a writer and as a person. And I believe that those two things are really uh, closely linked. I don't believe you can do one without the other. So my goal as a person, and I did not intend <clears throat> to share this with you when I started the video, but here we go. Um, my intent is to be unconditionally loving. That's who I want to be as a person. I want to uh, get away from the platform of false ego, the identity with myself as my body. I want to act from the soul level, the soul platform. That's where I want to come from. And I get that I'm far from that right now. And that's, I just want to take the little baby steps every single day. This is as a person. And I believe it absolutely will affect my writing. Absolutely. And again, to not think like, oh, I'm at this level. I'm at, the, you know, and then some people, they've they appreciate me as a person and who I am. Thank you for that if you're one of them. And, you know, I have a long way to go. So I would love to know, please, in the comments below, put down something, put down either baby steps or big steps, what you want to do, who you want to be, how you want to be, right? Put down any of those things in the comments below. Let me know. I want to be more this as a writer, as a person, whatever. I think it's all, all linked together. It's all important. And, uh, and that's what I wanted to share with you today. So I plan to upgrade the quality of my videos, of these videos, in terms not just of content, but, you know, to be more entertaining and, and, and even interesting. I think they're interesting already, but, you know, I want to make them more interesting. I want to keep going that way. So that's my plan for 2022. I will have my regular videos coming out again uh, in January. So stay tuned, and uh, and this has been a pleasure. I really enjoyed this. This was a little unexpected for me. I didn't plan to say what I said today, but 
But there you go. This is Dada Groover with the Inspired Writer, and please do cl click subscribe if you are interested in getting notifications when these videos come out. And thank you so much for being here. I have a wonderful holiday season. However you celebrate, however you celebrate your holidays, enjoy them, enjoy people if that's what you do. And I'll see you in January.